Today, we are going to discuss about circles determined by three points. More generally, a circle may be made to satisfy any three conditions which, when expressed analytically, led to three consistent equations for determining the constants. The three tangents may be given or two points in the radius, and etc. For this topic, we're going to determine the values for D, E, and F by using the three points and generating an equation for determining its values. For our example, find the equation of the circle through the points 1, 1, 2, negative 1, and 2, 3. So for in this kind of problem, we're going to solve for the equation of the circle given yung three points niya. Wherein, this will be 1, 1, 2, negative 1, and 2, 3. Itong three points na ito, these three points are located along the circumference of the circle. So how can we solve for the equation of the circle? Okay. Since located siya sa circumference niya, dapat masatisfy niya yung general equation ng circle. Where yung general equation ng circle is given by x squared plus y squared plus dx plus ey is equal plus f is equal to 0. Ito yung dapat masatisfy ng bawat points para masabi na located niya talaga siya along the circumference of the circle. So, ang kailangan lang para natin mahanap is yung value ng D, ng E, at ng F. So, next step is generate tayo ng three equations from these three points. Okay, for Y1, ganito ang nagawin natin. Alam natin na yung 1 and 1, this is X and this is Y. Okay, substitute natin yung values dito sa general equation natin. Our x is 1, and then for 1 squared, plus yung y natin is 1 din, 1 squared, plus d, x, our x is 1, plus e, yung y natin is 1, plus f, is equal to 0. Therefore, yung equation natin is 1 squared plus 1 squared, 1 plus 1 is 2 plus d times 1, d, e times 1, e, plus f is equal to 0. So, ito yung na-generate natin na equation from the first point na 1 and 1. Katawagin natin itong equation number 1. Okay. Next is mag-generate tayo ng second equation from our second point na 2, negative 1. Okay, same lang yung gagawin natin doon sa una. This our x, this our y. 2 squared, yung y natin is negative 1, squared plus d times 2, plus e times negative 1, plus f is equal to 0. I simplify 2 squared, 4, plus negative 1 squared, 4 plus 1 is 5, plus 2d, plus okay, negative shan, negative 1 times e, is equals to negative e. Okay, so we have negative e, plus f is equals to 0. Okay, this is our equation number 2. Okay, for our third equation, gamitin na natin itong point number, ay point 2, 3. Okay. 2, 3. Okay, same method. 2 squared plus 3 squared plus D times 2 plus E times 3 plus F is equal to 0. 2 squared is 4 plus 3 squared, which is 9, 4 plus 9 is 13, plus 2D, 
plus 3e plus f is equals to 0. Okay, this is our equation number 3. Okay. So, ang hinahanap natin, ang goal natin is mahanap natin yung values ng d ng e at ng f para makakuha natin yung general equation na yan. Ay, since given tayo ng 3 equations and 3 unknowns, the only way na masolve natin yung 3 unknowns is to apply the method yung substitution and elimination method. So, okay. Una, una natin gamitin is yung equation number 1 at equation number 2. Okay, pag subtracting natin or rather add natin yung equation 1 at equation 2 para ma-cancel natin or mawala yung e. Okay. First step is add 1 and 2. Equation 2. Our equation 1 is 2 plus d plus e plus f is equals to 0. Equation 2 is 5 plus 2d minus e plus f is equals to 0. Okay. Add natin 2 plus 5 is 7. Okay. d plus 2d is 3d. Okay. e minus e is so 0. f plus f is 2f equals to 0. Okay, meron tayong ika-fourth na equation. This is our equation number 4. Okay, next step is our next step is add natin yung equation 2 at yung equation 3. Equation 2 is 5 plus 2d minus e plus f equals to 0. Okay. Next is 13. Yung equation 3 natin is 13 plus 2d plus 3e is equals to f plus 0. Okay. Addition tayo, pero din mo natin na tayo magpuproceed sa addition. So, para ma-answer ulit yung e, yung equation ng e, multiply natin yung equation 2 by positive 3. Okay. So, so, yung kakalabasan natin is dito na. So, equation natin is 15 plus 6D minus 3E plus 3F is equals to 0. Kopyain natin yung equation 3. 13 plus 2D plus 3E plus F is equals to 0. 13 plus 15 is 28. 6D plus 2D is 8D. Okay, negative 3E plus 3E is 0. 3F plus F is 4F. This equals to 0. This is our equation number 5. Okay, our next step is isubtract natin yung equation 4 at equation number 5. Okay, equation number 4 is 7 plus 3D plus 2F is equal to 0. Tapos, yung equation number 5 natin is 28 plus 8D plus 4F plus 0. Okay, para ma-eliminate natin yung F, is multiply natin ito by negative 2. Okay, para maging negative 4 yung nasa F natin. Okay. Negative 2 times 7 is negative 14. Negative 2 times 3D is negative 6D. This will become negative 4F is equal to 0. Copy 28 plus 8D plus 4F is equal to 0. Okay. Proceed to proceed to addition. 
Okay, 20 minus 14 is positive 14. Okay. Negative 6D plus 8D is 2D. I okay. cancel na ito. Dahil negative 4F plus 4F is equals to 0. Okay, therefore, yung value ng D natin is 2D is equals to negative 14 or D is equals to negative 7. Okay, therefore, yung value ng D natin is negative 7. So, nabakuha natin yung ibang values, yung value ng E at yung value ng F. Okay, para makuha natin yung value ng F, substitute natin siya dun sa, ito, sa equation number 5. Okay, substitute D to 5. Okay, yung 5 natin is 28 plus 8 times 7 plus 4F is equals to 0. 28 plus 8 8 times 7 is 56 28 plus 56 plus 4F 4F is equals to 28 plus 56 Okay, negative 7 pala to. So, negative 56 28 minus 56 is negative 56 Transpose sa kabila, yung negative is magiging positive This is positive 28 oh, So, therefore, yung value ng F natin is 28 over 4 is positive Okay, F pala Positive 7. Ito yung value ng F natin. So, para makuha yung E, pili lang tayo dito sa equation 1, 2, or 3. Okay, para mas madali, pili natin yung equation number 1. Okay, substitute D and F to 1. Ito. So, yung equation 1 natin is 2, yung D is okay, minus 7 na siya, negative 7, plus E, plus yung F natin is 7, is equals to 0. Okay, cancel to, cancel to, 2 plus E, is equals to 0. Therefore, our value for E is, transpose natin, negative 2. Our value for E is negative 2. Okay. So, meron na tayo coefficients sa D, sa E, at sa F. So, substitute na natin siya dun sa general equation ng no circle. So, dito na lang natin siya isulat. The general equation of the circle will become X squared plus Y squared okay. negative 7 7X Okay, yung E natin is negative, therefore minus 2Y. Yung F natin is 7 is equals to 0. Okay, there, this is the general equation ng circle given yung 3 points na 1, 1, 2, negative 1, 2, 3. Okay. To check kung tama yung nakuha nating general equation ng circle, Plot natin siya sa Cartesian coordinate plane. First, plot muna natin yung three given points. The three given points are 1, 1, 2, negative 1, and our last point is 2, 3. So this time, plot natin yung resolve natin na general equation ng circle. This is x squared plus y squared minus 7x minus 2y plus 7 is equal to 0. 
Okay, ito yung graph ng circle natin. As you can see in our graph, yung three points na given is lying along the circumference of the circle. So therefore, yung nakuha natin general equation is correct. 